Hey guys, it's Physio Chris. All right, so we've had a couple questions on can you strap your own ankle? The short answer is yeah, yes you can strap your own ankle. Is it harder? Yes, but here I'm gonna give you a few little tips on how to do your own ankle. All right guys, so first of all, you wanna put your foot up onto a step because that puts your foot into a bit of dorsiflexion. So you're gonna strap your foot in a neutral position. So first of all, we're just gonna lay down an anchor and since your foot isn't cylindrical, it's kind of cone shaped, so you might have to go on a little bit of an, ang on an angle. I don't want you to place any pressure down with this, so that's nice and light. Next of all, you've got your stirrups, so these go from inside to out. So as you can see here, just light pressure on the way down, just patting it down so it forms with the ankle, and just putting a little bit of upward pressure on the way up. So these two stirrups that I've laid down, uh, they cover those two bony landmarks you have on the outside and on the inside of your ankle. So you want to make sure they're both covered with these two strips. For those of you with bigger ankles, you might want to use three strips or three stirrups here. All right, so after your two stirrups, you've got a six. So these sixes, as the name suggests, look like the number six. So they go down straight and then they come across on an angle. The key to a six is to let it follow where the skin wants to take it. You don't want to pull on the tape because you'll get wrinkles in the tape and wrinkles in the tape can lead to cuts. With your sixes, you want to make sure there's one six that goes inside to outside and then one, the other six goes from outside to inside, making sure you only ever place a light pressure on the six when you're pulling up. Never pull down on a six. After your two sixes, you've got two heel locks. So a heel lock is the tricky one, so it goes across the front, around the back, around the back of the heel, and then it follows basically where your sixes came back up and you can do one each side. So this ankle taping here was a very standard ankle taping. If you feel like you need more support, you can add more sixes or you can add more heel locks as you feel is necessary. As you can see, I use two stirrups here. If you've got a larger ankle, sometimes you need to use three stirrups to cover the entire malleoli. Once you've done your two heel locks, you wanna lock it off. Same technique as the anchor. So you just wanna go on a slight angle. Doesn't need to put any pressure on this. And this is just gonna cover off your loose ends at the top. And there you have it, a nice strong ankle taping.